In your commitment news this morning, a special election ballot item could widen internet access for Vermonters across the state. Other areas of Vermont have already started tackling the problem. Now Chittenden County could be next in line. NBC 5's Adrian Pastor joins us live from Williston from the polling site with the details. Adrian. Yes, Sarah Beth Zuri, currently about 30% of homes and businesses have access to high speed internet in Chindin County. And this election day, voters in five cities and towns will need to decide if universal broadband is right for them. In Williston, there's currently a, approximately 140 home address that don't have access to broadband. To achieve more equitable internet access, the state of Vermont has worked to form the Vermont Community Broadband Board. The VCBB, in partnership with the Chittenden County Regional Planning Commission, hopes voters in Shelburne, South Burlington, Essex, Essex Junction, and Williston will see the value in forming a communication union district, better known as CUDs, which will work to build a universal communication infrastructure. If formed, the Chittenden County CUD would join over 200 cities and towns, increasing internet speeds at no additional cost to taxpayers. It's not a luxury. Good broadband is an essential service, whether it's for telehealth, remote learning, economic development, just accessing democracy, like it's energy equity. It touches on everything in our lives right now. As of right now, the state has nine communication union districts. Five of these are beginning to uh, beginning the initial phases of construction to implement broadband. To pass, just two towns will need to vote in favor of the CUDs. If the vote passes, other towns will have a chance to join on on the future. You can either vote in person or fill out the ballot that was sent to you by mail. And according to the Chindon County Regional Planning Commission, a possible timeline on what a rollout will look like is still in the works, but they'll have a better idea of what this will look like after Election Day. We're live in Williston, Adrian Pastor, NBC5.